The man, the myth, the legend, El Presidente is back here yet again. We're going to be playing the mission, Leon must die. So this explains where I guess Leon went disappearing for the first part of the campaign. We've got to attract enough tourists before you run out of time. Now, unfortunately, El Presidente Arsene Robert isn't a massive fan of tourists. So this will be quite the challenge and we are yet to decide what island to go on. So I'm just going to click. There we go. Proto Coco it is. History changes for no man. All of my attempts to alter the timeline, both minor and major, have been unsuccessful. It is time for the most drastic of measures. To save the world, I must kill Leon Kane. Assassinations are not my style. I prefer to crush my opponents and let them experience utter defeat, live and in person. However, I will use any means to make sure that Day Zero never dawns. That put away that cheese grater penultimo. Leon will be difficult to kill. He is devious and has evaded assassins many times. I will need a number of agents to dispose of him. I will use tourism as a cover to train the best spies in the world. I'm sure the US will have something to say about that. <coughs> but let's go ahead and living in the past i already experienced once makes me feel smart and ready for anything you command it is payback time for leon kane mr kane i think he will escape judgment while faking his own death and fleeing to another country but he counts his chicken before they hatch that you surely remember that one in every hundred tourists is a cold-blooded killer with every tour with enough tourists we can select the best killers brainwash them and plant them as sleeper agents in every country around the world have 400 tourists visit to select the best sleeper agents and we win the mission with 400 tourists although dun 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 it is a timed mission alrighty so unfortunately I didn't set up tourism imagine if you set up tourism before this actual mission you would be swimming in money alrighty so let's have a look at some tourist destinations do we have yeah what do you have the ancient ruins alrighty this is a very nice then, island, though. Do not get off the beach and go straight to the factory. We will die poor. Well, I can tell them that it's a blatant lie. The more people come to the beach, the more drinks I sell. <laughs> Can't you see that having fun is the economic backbone of Tropico? Alrighty, whatever you say there, ma'am. Let's go with flexible and the peaceful. Alright, so we've got uh, most of our research for the mission done and dusted. We've got our high schools all up here all right we should be making a lot of money very shortly as well uh, i'll probably need a hospital and all of that uh, because in the cold war you probably unlock the most things i would say uh, in the whole game so oh okay we've only got 180 months let's go ahead and get started then shall we with tourism i think we'll go with i'd love to get a cruise ship but unfortunately that's locked for us at the moment um, so I think Country Hotels provides rooms for six eco-tourist families. Service quality depends on beauty. Service quality drops if there are many new building needs. But okay. I guess it works like that with all of these um, places. Apart from the family resort. Provides rooms for 12 slob tourist families. Service quality depends on beauty. And service quality is increased for each entertainment building nearby. Alrighty, so I'll go ahead and... Uh, place that here let's just zoom in a little bit so we can have a better look at the economy hotel <laughs> looks more like a typical apartment than an economy hotel if you ask me um, also um, let's just click on these ancient ruins you can construct the ancient ruins luxury entertainment building at this location so let's go check that out um, ancient ruins here we go for high school educated workers oh. Oh, no, no, sorry, that's not... Yeah, it is. Okay, so the one star, I guess, is um, just normal education. And then two stars is high school, and then three stars is college, isn't it? Yeah. And then the number tells us how many people it can get. Alrighty. Uh, let's build the ancient ruins over here as well. And we are losing money, quick smart, which is okay with me. I'll build that there. And, of course, I like my straight roads. There we go. Have a nice couple of straight roads over here. Um, where is this road going to? Alright, that'll work. 
and then we'll also join up this gold mine road with the oil well and join it up over here. Beautiful. I'll also join this up like that. There we go. Right, so we should be fairly well off. Uh, we just need to wait up for a couple of these ships to come in so we can start making some money. Uh, in the meantime, I'm pretty sure there was a mine over here. I guess there wasn't. I guess the mine is over here. We've got... Oh, there's not much of an amount left. Uh, let's modernize all. And then we should be able to, here we go, get Rock Breaker and Water Cannons. And that, let's have a look, that gives us 21,000 extra just in time. We'll do that stuff over here as well. Alright, thankfully I upgraded that mine just before it turned to crap. Now modernize all the coal mines and we'll upgrade them as well. Alrighty. Now that we've got that done, we can have a look at the cars now. They look very different to what they did in the World War era. Although, don't the cars look the same in the Cold War and the modern era? Or modern times? I'm pretty sure they do, actually. Which would make sense, because Cuba is still, after the US trade embargoes and all, it's still very much behind the times. Uh, we're not able to upgrade our mines, actually. Interesting. As to why that is. All right, all right, all right. Let's see, are we able to upgrade? No, that's modern times for that. Should be able to upgrade most of these apartments, but we need electricity, so we'll get that with the uranium. Let's have a look at this side mission. Squabble, the Caribbean family has grown by one more member. Oh, there's a new country. Let's take advantage of our close vicinity to spread influence on the newcomer by sending them some help so they can start better off. The Yankees are bound to like this, as well as they consider the new nation to be part of their circle of influence. Alright. Um, what do we want to get up to? How's this building coming along? It's only 6%. Here we go. Someone's working on it. And predicted effectiveness is pretty damn amazing. Oh wow, we've already built ancient ruins. That came around pretty quick. We've got... What? There's a ridiculous amount of visitors. 40, 70 out of 75. Alright, uh, we need to start bringing them tourists in, so let's go ahead and sucker them in by going to tourism and... How do you bring those tourists in again? They come in just a cruise ship, don't they? I'm pretty sure, yeah. They come automatically into your docks, so you don't need to place any special buildings, I'm fairly certain of that. If it is, that's rather embarrassing, because I don't know. But I'm pretty sure, yeah. Um, now, natural gas. I'm pretty sure that's in infrastructure. No. I should say here. By natural gas, do you mean oil? Because I don't think you do. That's an oil deposit. I have no idea how we work on natural gas. We'll have to have a look at that. Let's have a look at these mines that we have around here. Uranium and, oh, a bit more coal. We tried to discover democracy. Right, so we've got new constitutional options in the Cold War. Let's have a look. High Liberty, Assassinate and Banish are limited. Special citizens are harder to discover. I really need a lot more liberty in the Tropico. And I don't really assassinate or banish people, so we'll go with Open Society. Um, let's see, budget impact on building effectiveness is stronger. Or buildings with managers can attain 10 bonus effectiveness. I'll go with Free Market. Because I do like upgrading the wages of our people. And media independence will be... Well, we can't have that much liberty. I think media requires higher budget. And journalists convert voters for your cause. Subsidized media. That sounds good. More people on our side, the better it is, after all. The less dissent. Alright, we can't upgrade those tenements, after all. Uh, let's have a look at how everything else is doing over here. We've got tobacco. We should be working on a... Where is our tobacco? Here it is. A cigar factory. Yeah, so we need a bit more electricity and all. We are sending in quite a bit of people, so that's all good. Uh, let's see. How many... 15,000 in both these docks. Okay. That's not too bad. Could be better, of course, but... I'm not one to complain. Now, I might be able to export some things. 
such as mining and logging, export some iron. Here we go. Add a ship. Add two ships. Natural gas. I'll take that as well. Although now I need to find the natural gas reserves. And I'm not quite sure how it works. What building do we need to place? I would have thought it's the geothermal plant for natural gas. But obviously it can't be. Um, raw resources, an oil refinery, an automated mine. Oil wells, no, it's not here. It wouldn't be in industry goods and it wouldn't be in luxury goods, though, would it? No, it's not here. It wouldn't be over here. Research and education, wait, it could be in entertainment environments. Waste and tr waste treatment plant. Uh, circus, a Cineplex. I haven't gotten one of them. Uh, tourism, no, it definitely wouldn't be in tourism. Research and education, we can get an observatory and a science lab and all. Hmm. I'd love to know how you get the natural gas. The Caribbean family has grown. I can, of course, abandon that mission. But that is very interesting. What's that? Oh, that's just one random really high tree. I guess you can't really do anything over in this side. Uh, but yeah, we should definitely check out the oil deposits. Maybe that's what they mean by natural gas. Because it can't be the geothermal power plant. It's not in military. Geothermal plants, no. Obviously not. Hmm. Anyways, we can worry about that later. Uh, we need to keep on inviting those tourists in here. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, place some more attractions and all. can upgrade this as well, but unfortunately, that's alien artifacts. All right, we can add some there. Uh, let's go ahead and provide some entertainment, some restaurants around. Um, also, let's see. A circus. Place that over there. And we'll go ahead and uh, start quick building a lot of these things. Uh, we should be making a lot more money from all of these buildings. The steel mill is going alright. Uh, we are importing... Oh, no. Trade here. No, but we do have coal, and we do have iron. Alright, that's all we need, actually. Because we're working on a coal mine over there. So that's alright. How are our iron mines doing? Actually, they're both doing really, really well. There we go. Now we can modernize these iron mines. Before, we couldn't. That was really weird. Um, let's go modernize all. There we go. And get the rock breaker abilities and all that. Heavy crusher as well. Which will help us out. And that spares us a lot more positions as well. So now we should have like a couple more unemployed people. There we go. Oh, well, we've got eight unemployed, 36 open jobs. Uh, so let's go ahead and assign maybe some managers. A tycoon. Uh, we'll go with a tycoon over like in a college. Here we go. Tycoon. Hire him. Let's go ahead and maybe get some uh, reactive armor. Here we go. That's what we should have gotten. Oh, well, that's what we've got now. Let's see, assign someone building effectiveness increased by five. Increases beauty. Increases budget by eight. Mentor. We'll go as tactician here. Hire them. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, upgrade our production facilities as well. So, hmm. Let's increase the building effectiveness by five. Building effectiveness Wait, over here. Oh. Remember that show? Okay. And that was just a research. We are researching things really quickly. Uh, we're able to get res rolling shop now as well. Okay. I'll go for that. And let's go get some supervisors again. Okay. So we've got two supervisors. Oh, no. Do we not have a supervisor here? No, we don't. I thought I added one there already. 
Uh, managed building is 20% more durable. Financier, cheap skates. Budget of the managed building decreased by 10%. All right. Actually, the steel mill is rather expensive, so that could help out. And I'm pretty sure I had another production building. Uh, the rum distillery. That's what we'd like. And we'll go with... We'll go with the union leader. Actually, it wouldn't hurt to switch the union leader over here because then people will be really happy with their jobs. Anyways, it's not really that much of a thing. Not much of a problem. Alright, so we better get to uh, getting some more tourists though. Um, hopefully, our builders will come and finish working on that. It's taking me to their sweet time though with that. So let's go ahead and uh, quick build some of this stuff then. Uh, luxury entertainment tourism. Historic Inn provides rooms for three culture tourist families. Service quality is increased for each colonial building nearby. We don't really have all that many colonial buildings to build though, do we? Um, a hacienda. Uh, I guess they add to the effects, both of them. Uh, where's the entrance? I think that's... There we go. It's like that. And I don't have enough money. Jeez, that costs a lot of money. There we go. Here's some builders. Oh, and the road just upgraded in front of our very eyes. Olga a yank on her beard. Right. Jeez. That's when he thought the radio voice of it couldn't get any weirder. Uh, how can we upgrade the dock? Trade ships carry 50% more exports. And each dock provides one extra trade ship. Jeez, that would be pretty useful with all these um, docks that we've got over here. But I'm yet to find out how you export natural gas. Because all I can see are oil deposits. Maybe there's like an overlay that we can have a look at. Overlays, islands. No, there's not all that many overlays anymore either. Current pollution. <laughs> the actual whole city is quite polluted, but pollution doesn't really affect me that much. So that's all good. Uh, how are you guys coming along with these buildings? Let's speed it up uh, just a tad. There we go. Economy Hotel is built. Uh, so let's go with some family resorts. Might be, oh really we're not able to squeeze it in there? That's a shame. Place that there and I think we'll settle for all of that. I'll also build a cabaret. Wait, what type of families does a cabaret bring? Richer citizens and tourists. And children can't visit. I'm assuming that, yeah, that cabaret is still on the road, so that's good. We've it's not that bad. The mineral oil, which can be processed into gasoline. The cars in Tropical no longer need to run on magic. Our profits are guaranteed until someone starts selling oil cheaper than us. Then we should bomb and invade them. Okay. <laughs> I like what you're getting at there, Penultimo. Well, oil well, oil refinery resource unlocked. Oil and natural gas resources now exploitable. All right, so I don't know where the natural gas is, to be honest, because all I can see are oil deposits. More oil deposits. More oil deposits. I don't see no natural gas around. There must be something that I'm missing here. I, I'm sure they explained this in the tutorial, but I did not play through the whole tutorial. But that's. Interesting. Because I, I doubt that... Um, actually, there might be an upgrade to the oil wells. You know what I could be able to do is... Go over here, raw resources, oil well. And then I'll just... Uh, should I quick build it? I'm not quite sure. How are our construction workers doing? And where are they? They are... No, that's Teamsters... Construction office, hey? It'd be a wrap around here. They put it they put the buildings really weirdly. Now that's a lumber mill. We've got another main mission that we can do. Here we got construction office. We'll get a manager and we'll go with Um effectiveness on maximum budget increased. Let's just pay them a lot more. There we go. 
so the job quality is going to be a lot better. And we can stop complaining about their silly waste of time. Comrade Presidente, a man is not complete until he has found his connection to untamed nature. Untamed nature it is. A sleeper agents must be able to survive the wildest places on earth. Pit the sleeper agents against our most vicious beasts. Tapirs, llamas and sloths. Those llamas are definitely rather intense. The starving animals will be fed and the agents who survive will be proven by evolution itself. Have a national park. So our reward is 20 tourism rating and 15 standing with the environmentalists. Alright, I need as much standing with the environmentalists as I can possibly get. So, that would be in tourism. No, it would be national park. That's where it would be. And of course, these national parks are massive, so... We'll place that right. I don't think... No, that, that wouldn't be connected. I think it's red there, isn't it? Oh, no, it's still connected. Okay, that's good. I thought we weren't connected to the road. But, alas, we are. All right. Now, let's have a look at our construction offices. They should begin to work much better now. I can also go ahead and uh, quick build some of these buildings. Uh, how's this coming along? I'm going to quick build that because we've got more than enough money for it. Now, here we go. Effectiveness is increased... By 20, the oil well generates 30% more pollution. Or increase the reserves of oil and natural gas in the deposit by 15,000. So the natural gas is over here. Oh, I see. Okay. Too easy. Yeah, I thought, I thought that would, how it would be how it works. And I'm not really all that fussed about pollution. Although we do need to watch out that it doesn't affect the tourist areas. Um, are these guys building anything? Here we go. This is being built. Residente, we and we've unlocked the airport. So the airport will be built as our Presidente demands it. Place it right there. And unfortunately, I'm not able to quick build it. Alright. Still haven't had any... Here we go. Finally, we're getting some tourists. But we still haven't had any... Um, elections or anything. I think it'll be a little while before there will be any, but let's keep on doing our thing then, shall we? Uh, okay, so we've got one oil well. I think I'll build another one over here so we can uh, get some more natural gas, actually. I think that's too bad of an idea. And the oil refinery, I guess, refines your oil. What do you know? Who would have thunk it? Okay. There we go. Alright, yeah, I definitely need to watch out on the pollution. Let's have a look at overlays. Current pollution. Okay, it's not bad over here at all. It doesn't seem like it. Although, why is the overlay just over here? Like, it's still showing up green here. Are coming, As our constitution dictates, we have there we go. Speaking of elections, there we go. I think I'm going to have to uh, rig this one. Uh, let's have a look how I can make people happier, though. Got a lot of open jobs, so people shouldn't be complaining all that much. Um, happiness. Housing. Housing is pretty good, even though we've got a lot of homeless people. Healthcare needs to be improved. Crime safety is right up there. All right, religion. Jeez, why'd that drop down so much? And liberty needs to be increased as well. And I guess media buildings increase liberty. So healthcare is the big thing. Let's get right on top of that with all our money. That's not going to be a problem. Um, what are we researching? I should go for... There we go. I'm going to go for the peaceful right now. There we go. Um, let's go with a vehicle factory. Amend the constitution more often if we want to. Although I never really do. Uh, all I care about is the peaceful at the moment. So we've got that. It's not going to be a problem. Uh, also, quick build a lot of these buildings because we're making ridiculous amounts of money. Alrighty. The Russians want to start formal diplomatic relations with you. However, they say something is hampering the dialogue between our great nations. 
I went on a trip to the USSR to find out what it is. And now that my hangover is over, I can finally tell you what it is. And it is rum. So that's not going to be too difficult because we have a rum distillery. What do you know? Okay, let's get that. Even though I don't think we have all that many taverns and all around here. Have a look at what these people are complaining about. Oh wow, the communists want increased liberty. Sense it makes none. Friendship between the USSR and Tropico. The bad news is I got kissed by at least two <laughs> Russians. Yes, those Eastern Europeans definitely like to kiss each other. And so do those uh, Arabs. Uh, we have one free, indus free industry building. I think that's probably the best bet. Let's have a look at some industries that we can set up though. Another rum distillery? Probably wouldn't hurt, actually. Not able to get a chocolate factory, if only we could. I think it, well, I'll go with a vehicle factory or maybe a jewelry workshop a little bit later on. Here we go. We are getting a couple of more tourists. Still not as large of an amount as I would like. Also upgrades. Oh, okay. Can't get that. Righto. Um, quick build that airport and back to welfare and media Can't get the hospital which we'll be able to get pretty soon, but I'll get a couple of clinics or two Or oh, if it'd be if I'd play oh yes, we can place it right there. It's pretty great stuff uh, Quick build that and I'll also upgrade it and I'll try to find the other One that we placed around here it must be somewhere around I think it was all the way over here if I remember correctly somewhere. No, I guess not. Uh, what I'll do though is let's go with some more housing apartments. Here we go. We can go get apartments these days. That's pretty great. I'll actually I'll quick build them. Even though our money has dropped down quite considerably. That should help us out a lot more. Now we've already got a couple of families moving in. Next thing that I really need is electricity. Oh, Liberty happiness has increased by a little bit. We'll go with uh, a bit more media though. Uh, can I look at overlays and agriculture city? Have a look at Liberty. All right, we'll definitely get around to upgrading that. All right. All right, so wow. You definitely get a lot of money through all our exports, so that's for certain. I'm not gonna get that embassy. Um, and I'm not going to get a customs office. What I am going to get is where well, we're searching pretty quickly. We should be able to build that power plant, uranium power plant, pretty soon. Or nuclear one uh, would make more sense. Uh, but what am I going for right now? I'm going for... Why do I suffer from short-term memory loss? Why, oh, why? Oh, that's what we need. Another cathedral as well. Well, not another one. Just a cathedral. Because we don't have any. I built it over there and that will be perfect yes that is perfect there we go so we're able to do that all right so that's that done there's something all oh, right media buildings that's what i wanted to do uh, so we're already halfway there let's go with the okay you're able to build tv stations in the cold war era very cool uh, let's go with the newspaper increase the libertoire of the people Get some high school workers up in the joint. To influence the outcome of coming elections. Better safe than sorry. <laughs> With the election being this close, I'm not risking it. All right, we are exporting the natural gas. Let's go ahead and uh, quick build the national park. But after the auto save, goddamn pesky auto saves. The election results are in. Thanks to a clever interpretation of the numbers, we've decided that you have won, Presidente. All right. We definitely got rather lucky there. Why can I not quick click on... Here we go. It seems like the National Park is a bit glitched because you need to click on the actual building. Maybe that's just how it works with everything. Presidente, I was doing some experiments with the products of neutron... 